Welcome to Chris's Vintage RC Cars. Today we're going to go over one of my pride and joys. It is a RC10 RPM Ultra Narrow Chassis. This is one I actually bought off eBay years ago. I think for like $200 for an unopened bag. I still have the card in the direction it came with the thing. Never been ran. All new parts for the most part. It's basically my one of my pride and joy unicorn cars. It's ready to run, but basically, like I said, never has been run. It has the recommended Losi body on it with the team associated spoiler. Taking the body off, you can see all Novak Electronics, Futaba, Servo. Didn't want to drill, so I mounted the antenna like there. As you can see, I used the clear shocks. They're not really practical for anything, they just look cool. I have a uh, clear gel soap in it because these things are known for leaking. I also put the progressive shocks, I believe they are. Shock cap set up on it with the extra oil. I didn't use the RPM bulkhead cover because the kit I got didn't come with the RPM shock tower. So I used an original one, then used a carbon fiber bulkhead brace with a regular body mount. Hopefully, you can see. I put the RPM truck transmission in it, the 265. You have to modify a little bit, grind it to get air to fit. With a little work, she fits fine. This car here, I actually have, a, I can get it off quickly, a Lucy Hydro Drive set up on it. Most of my RC-10s, even, even they're associated, when I grew up as a kid, for some reason, whenever I run the Losi Hydro Drive on my RC-10s, the car always did good, had the best luck with it. Let's see. Hydro Drive. These are the reproduction wheels. I believe I got them off eBay like a year or so ago. Well, I hope you enjoyed. Pictures of my RC10 RPM narrow chassis. If you want to see more, let me know. I actually have, I believe, like eight of these cars total. They're various makes and forms. Have a good one, guys.